Hello family. Um, happy Wednesday. Um, I'm so excited to be able to meet y'all in person finally in like a week and a half. Um, I can't believe the time is finally here. I could not be more excited. Um, and I just wanted to share a couple quick reflections about um, VSTT. Um, so I wanted to share about what have I learned so far in VSTT about my role as a teacher. Um, and I think it's a little cheesy, but I think I've learned just that I do have the ability to be that change maker and um, that courageously creative leader. I think that going into this, I was like, how can I, you know, just graduated college, have it make any sort of change in a community that I've never even been to before. Um, and I think that I've learned through VSTT that I do have those skills. Um, I've learned that my role is to make um, an unapologetically inclusive and equitable classroom. And I've learned that I have the ability to do that. I've learned how to implement those norms, how to work with students to implement those norms. And so I'm super excited about that. Um, so another thing I wanted to share was how I've been pushed to grow as a teacher leader during VSTT. Um, and something that I think kind of sums up a lot of how I've been pushed to grow and a lot of like the reframing that I've done is a quote from, or a mindset from our supporting our differently abled students module the other night. Um, and that was about framing are working specifically with students um, or with our differently abled students, but I think it applies to all sorts of students in their identity backgrounds, is um, stressing accommodations instead of modifications. Uh, so accommodations is how we make an equitable classroom, how we level the playing field, but keep the bar really high and strive for success for all of our students rather than modifications, which is lowering the bar and you know, taking our eyes off the prize that all students can succeed and will succeed and will thrive um, with their unique individual strengths in the classroom. And so I think I look forward to, you know, continuing to challenge my thinking about that and be really purposeful about how to make a classroom um, that makes sure that all my students can succeed and, you know, strives into that model of accommodations but not modifications. Um, and then what I'm excited about as VSTT is drawing to a close is just coming to Miami. I've already made such awesome connections and made such awesome community, or met such awesome community members. Shout out Golden Apples. Shout out Yoga with Smina and Enrica. Um, shout out Val and Caitlin in our house. My little brother just yelled, um, but here he is. But yeah, I'm so excited y'all. I can't wait to meet y'all. Can't wait to get in the Miami context and I'll see y'all soon.